Hi, in this video we're going to show you a nice uh, alternative to the Windows Sticky Notes. It's called Stickies, so it kind of does the same thing but has a lot more features than the default Windows Sticky Notes. Alright, so here I have them side by side. So here's the uh, Sticky Notes from Windows. So here are your options. You know, add a new note. You could change some colors, delete it, uh, change your formatting, add a list and some pictures. And so here is a note from Stickies. So if you right click it, you see you have a bunch of options here for saving, uh, storing, making a tag, printing, sleeping it. So if you want to have like a reminder that pops up at a certain time, uh, attaching items to it, making an actual note stack, setting an alarm, keeping it on top, you know, adding a title, changing the color. Uh, you could actually roll it up so it kind of stays out of the way and unroll it. Lock the contents, scroll bar, set the skins, opacity, styles, check the properties, which we'll get to in a second. And then once you install the program, you have it running down in your system tray, and then you could just right click on it. And then you have some other options here. You make a new note stack, which is like a stack of notes, a hide or show all the notes, a rescue off screen. If it goes off the screen, manage all your notes, a friend settings, other settings, you know, for the desktop, new notes, appearance, alerts, network. You want to enable networking with your notes, uh, sync with friends, email, manage, and so on. So I'm kind of recording at a low resolution, so that's why this is kind of large on the screen there. Okay, so if you want to make a new note, you could click on new note to make just a new blank note. And another cool option, let's say we copy some text here from a website. Control C. And then we could do a new note from the clipboard. So I'm like, it puts it in there into a note. Same with pictures. So let's say we copy this picture here. New note from clipboard. Now we have that right in our new note. Then you also have some options too. Then you also do a new note from a screen area or screenshot. So screenshot will capture the whole screen or screen area. You could just draw a box like so. And now that image is in your sticky notes. And like I said, if you have a lot of images here, you could just right click, show and hide them all as needed. Set them all to be rolled up if you want to kind of do it like that. Set all to be on top, not on top. Lock the contents of the notes. Adjust the width automatically. Have scroll bars on or off. And then once again, like I said, I'm recording at a low resolution for this video, so that's why they're so big on the screen there, so they won't be as large uh, when you're actually using this on your computer. Then you can highlight your text here, select all, insert a link, change your fonts, highlights, paragraph settings, cut, copy, and paste, undo, Let's set a title. So now we have a title bar on top of our note here as well. So this comes in handy if you were to roll up the note. Then you could see what the uh, content of the note is. So if you were to right click a note, any note, go to properties, then you can kind of get an idea of what's going on here. You have your home with kind of like statistics of how many notes you have. Uh, your notes here. You can right click on them. Close, store, delete, save content, attach. Set the color. So these are your stack notes if you had any. Attached notes if you had any of those. Any ones that are sleeping, recurring, uh, calendar, closed notes, ones with tags, stored. You can make a folder to store your notes to kind of keep them organized. Uh, search your notes and so on. So as you can see, it does a lot more than the uh, built-in Windows sticky notes. So if you are the type who likes to use these notes but wants uh, some extra functionality, you might want to check out stickies. All right, so I'll put a link in the description where you could download it. It's free to use, and then you can see how you like it. 
All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.